Hello traders everywhere, Jeremy Lutz coming to you from the digital studios of Market Club. Both the Dow and S&P 500 have hit new intraday highs today and are looking to close out the week at record highs along with the NASDAQ. The latest move higher has been driven by a weaker US dollar and strong earnings season so far. And this week has seen some overall market volatility with a couple down days, but a strong finish in going into the end of the week will push all three main indexes on track for their best four-week rally since 2016. And as you can see, we're taking a look at the S&P 500 here on a weekly chart that I like to do on Fridays to kind of get an idea of where the overall uh, week is finishing at. So I have a chart analysis score plus 100 with green trade triangles across the board. You can see currently trading at 2,860.68, just shy of an all-time high, up 1.79% on the week. And our key level watch has moved up to 2,736.06. A move below that level would issue a red weekly trade trial indicating a move to a sidelines position. Dow Jones currently trading 26,512.48, uh, up 1.68% on the week with a chart analysis score plus 100, indicating that overall the long term trend is still up and gaining strength for the Dow Jones. Key level to watch has moved to 25,235.41. A move below that level would issue a red weekly trade triangle indicating a move to a sidelines position. NASDAQ currently trading at 7,476.44 with a chart analysis score plus 100, up 1.95%, almost 2% on the week. Key level to watch is 7,111.52. A move above. Below that level would issue a red weekly trade trial indicating a move to a sidelines position for the NASDAQ. Moving to the dollar index, which is still under some pressure and continuing to weaken. Currently trading at 88.70, down 1.85%. That is continuing its downslide to the, to the low side there. Chart now scores negative 100, indicating that overall a strong trend is still down for the U.S. dollar. Key level remains 92.36. A move above that level would issue a green weekly trade triangle, indicating a move to a sidelines position. Crude oil currently trading at 66.24, up 4.6% on the week with a chart now score plus 100, looking to regain some momentum after a down week last week. Key level for crude oil to watch will be 64.34. A move below that level would issue a red daily trade triangle, indicating a move to a sidelines position on the short term time frame. However, overall, the chart now scores plus 100, indicating that the long term trend is still up for crude oil. We'll look at gold here again, much like crude oil bouncing back from a loss last week, but up trading uh, about 1.46% on the week with a chart now score plus 100, trading at 1,352.50 on the day. Key level to watch would be 1,339.10. A move below that level would issue a red daily trade triangle indicating a move to a sidelines position. Go ahead and take a look at Williams and Sonoma. Currently trading at 53.08, down uh, almost 4% on the week, continuing to come under some sidelines pressure with a chart analysis score plus 65, indicating that overall the trend is weakening. Um, Move our stop up a little bit to 51.94, we would issue a red weekly trade triangle, indicating a move to the sidelines for Williams and Sonoma. This trade's really gone nowhere, and we've just been kind of bouncing back and forth along this channel, but. Uh, you know, haven't given up yet, so we'll keep an eye on it. And we'll go take a look at Alibaba, who's finally starting to pay off from our monthly entry signal that we gave. Currently up about almost 11% on the week. Currently trading at 204.12, looking for this market to move higher. Key level to watch is 179.32. It's where we would issue a red weekly trade triangle indicating a move to a sidelines position. However, the chart analysis score is plus 100 indicating that all things are green across the board and we're looking forward to head higher and we'll actually just go ahead and turn on a daily chart here and you can see we got in on our monthly trade triangle on the 9th at 191.75 i had a lot of questions and comments when we saw this big move down on the 16th where it lost uh, almost three percent on the day but it didn't take out our exit level yet and i preached just be patient it's not uncommon 
when we get a new monthly trade triangle here to see a bit of a pullback in the market as that is a big trend change but it, we'd still look for the market to move higher from that point and as you can see we've had this big run up this week so currently trading at 20405 with your stop set at 179.32 looking for alibaba to head higher and i'll update some projections next week on that and we'll go ahead and take a look at the bitcoin market here and we'll go take a look at uh, brti the real-time cme index currently trading a little under 11,000 at 10,985.95 down about four percent on the day with a chart analysis score negative 70 kilo to watch will be 16,481.34 a move above that level would issue a green weekly trade triangle indicating a move to a long position again for bitcoin with that, every success. Have a great weekend, and I'll see you next week.